How's it going guys? Welcome back to NASCAR Thunder 2004. I was feeling good before this video until I realized, yes, this is Sonoma and yes, we should do pretty well, but then I forgot. I've never done a road course race with the 25% length. And obviously on road course racing, it is way easier to make mistakes. And me, the king of mistakes and losing focus, me, I have to run 25% at Sonoma, which would be the equivalent of around i think we're looking at 28 something laps somewhere around that point because i think it's 11 laps of 10 percent so 25 laps you know 26 laps somewhere around there is the is the race length uh that makes me really nervous i just don't know if i can go that long without a very bad mistake shout out to all the patreon members who always for the channel you guys are the absolute best as always and everyone who has subscribed now let's get into it. Get this green. Uh, I, I know, you know, I just don't like, I, I'm i sorry I don't like green race cars. It just doesn't work with me. I'm I'm annoyed by it. I don't like it. Uh, we are going to Sonoma. What color should I pick for Sonoma? I'm going to go back to, you know what? We're going to run a color we've never ran before. I'm going to go with a kind of weirdish. Okay, so like whatever this is, or it's one of these colors, these very light colors that I, I don't really know what they are we're gonna go with this or this no, no that's too much with this Th this is essentially white with a little shade of purple in it that, that is what we are going to run um and i, I you know it's, it, it's it's basically white now let, let's be honest wait a minute now i just realized that we are tied with tottenham in the points right now our, our rivals i cannot drive a white and black race car i can't i would be doing a disservice to my club so I'm just gonna go all black. No, but then that's black and white. Can't do. Nope. Nope. Can't do that. All right, we're running red, guys. Uh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I cannot disrespect my club Arsenal like that. I just can't. I can't. I know. I want to run an all white or an all black race car, but until May 12th happens, guys, and until this this fight for top four ends, I'm just not going to. I am just not going. You will not get me to represent Tottenham Hotspur colors. It just will not happen. I'm not wearing white. Right? I'm wearing yellow. All right, good. There's no club that wears yellow. It's actually, actually Arsenal's away. I'm, I'm supporting. I'm supporting, baby. Uh, let's go to team management. Uh, we have this. The sponsorship is ending very soon, guys. Three races left in the sponsorship, but we have a lot to do in the garage. So we got 1.21 million in the bank. We got three races left in the downforce. Now we have a lot to do here. So chassis. Let's go ahead and sell one of our chassis. Uh, hopefully it sells for a good amount. Sells for $137,000. This is going to be a quite quite a long intro, guys, because we have a lot to do. Um, if we were to build a new one, we have three pretty decent chassis, um, and I don't see us really working on the chassis anytime soon. Um, so we're going to go with the nine races and just let it, you know, let it fester, let it build, get a really good chassis for the end of the season. That is currently what's going on with our engine department, but we also do have to send a repair or an overall here. Um, we're going to go ahead and repair for now $146,000. Uh, let's go back to the chassis because we do need to send a repair there. If we overhaul it, it will get the tire wear up, but I just don't think it is worth the $348,000. So for now, we're going to do $162,000 to get that back up and going as soon as possible. And for the bodies, we are still building. We do need to do a few repairs here or an overhaul. Uh, repair, overhaul, that will get to a 66. I think this will stay at a 67. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and repair uh, this one for $151,000. That will leave us with uh, around 600,000, $647,000. Uh, the driver's sponsor prestige, associate sponsor prestige, and secondary prestige are all in the mid 80s. That is perfect, should give us some really good options for when we need to resign. If we go look in the standings, uh, I think it is Tony Stewart kill, still uh, controlling things with a 112 point gap. We are trying to inch our way to fifth. We are not that far behind. Uh, so let's see if we can. This should be a good race for us. We have Sonoma up next. We got Daytona coming soon. Let's see how this goes. Hey guys, it's going to be a really good race car. 73, 72 tire grip. Uh, we're going to run. I, I would like to save it for Daytona, but I, I'm not taking any risks. We're going to go ahead and try to win this race. I'm, I'm, not, I'm not saving anything. We're going to try and win this race. So this is lap one. I spun. So this is a this is a throwaway lap. We're going to be in last. So this puts a little bit more pressure on lap two. Um, I, we, we can definitely qualify in pole. That's not an issue. I just don't need to spin. So I, I'm just going to be very careful on this lap and just make sure that we just put a lap in. Uh, and that, that lap in should be good enough for pole but it's right here where i made a mistake and i made another mistake there L just losing way too okay i need to really focus i gotta shut up 
Okay, not a great lap, but it should be enough. Let's see if it is. It's going to be close. Yep. Yes, we got it. 111.2, pole position. Yeah, that was not a good lap. I think I probably ran a faster lap last season. <laughs> I think I was in the 110s last season. We got it by 5 tenths. That's not an indication of how, uh, how strong we are going to be in the race, though. Um, we saw that last season where in the race we really couldn't um, compete for the win. I also, one of the struggles on this game when it comes to road course racing is on the controller, usually, um, usually the shift buttons on modern games is X and A. Uh, and so you're able to like, you know, use the triggers and then shift with X and A with your thumb. But on the older games, it wasn't like that. And the only configuration um, that allows the triggers to, you know, to be the accelerator and the ga and the brake, because it used to be just A and uh, X was the accelerator and the brake, is the bumpers now. The bumpers are the, um, the shifters. So you have to hold the controller essentially like that. And it's just really, you know, uncomfortable a little bit. Uh, so... You having to do that for the entire lap instead of being able to shift with X and A is is definitely costing me time. Um, but hopefully in the during the race I kind of get used to it. And uh, again, just gotta be really careful. It's gonna be a long race. NASCAR Winston Cup racing in the Sonoma Valley today. EA Sports is live with flag to flag coverage of today's Dodge Save Mart 350 from the Infineon Raceway. This course should present quite a challenge to these drivers, wouldn't you agree? This track really shows off a driver's talents. This is truly a course where your skill alone can mean the difference between finishing first and 41st. The Unical 76 car has strung together back-to-back -to -back top fives, and I'm sure he'll try for another one. He can sure gain a lot of points if he continues his top five streak. It just goes to show it doesn't always take wins to move up in the points. Something a little out of the ordinary in this one for Ward Burton. Yeah, he is definitely not used to having to pick through traffic so early in a race. That can make for an exciting race for him, or it could be disastrous. You just never know when you start in the back. Brett Bodine is a rarity on the NASCAR circuit these days as the last of the owner drivers. That really is a lot for one man in these days of multi-car teams which can share information. good we have gordon stewart and jr right behind us so yeah, we're gonna get tested right away let me see if i can get to the lead right away we do and uh well i was confident trying to win this race before i started recording but now i'm just a little bit less here comes gordon i'm trying to be very careful and we've already lost the lead oh we got jr right below us as well just gotta be careful here yeah these guys are very very quick so just yeah. Okay, I just got to get into it. 27 laps. This race is 27 laps long. Uh, here comes Tony Stewart. Hey. Okay, yep, lost. All right, yep. Those 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 guys are just going to be tough. Mark Martin's coming away, too. He's down there somewhere. Just not able to get enough grip. We've fallen back to fifth. I swear I actually was better last season than this season, which makes no sense. Got to be careful in the hairpin. They're going to dive bomb me behind if they have enough. Oh, oh I was looking in the mirror. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Mark. <laughs> I'm not proud of that. Uh, left front damage, um, but that shouldn't really be a big issue. Um, but we are in fourth. I, I guess I'll take it. Uh, I'm getting into the groove. Lap three. I'm starting to feel very comfortable. Staying in third gear through the left right hander there before turn five. Uh, and that's helping me a lot. I, I think for some reason I was shifting into second gear there. And it just wasn't helping. Look at that run. Oh, <laughs> That's a beautiful run. It's not going to work out, though. Junior's probably going to come back underneath. Um, but that is going to set up the hairpin pretty nicely if you could just stay through the tunnel, uh, through the S's. And Junior taking some weird line there. That's going to be no... Oh, back end. I lost the back end there. I lost the back end on exit. And I'll have to wait till the next lap. Uh, I, I can definitely compete if I put the laps together. But the thing is, it's just so difficult to put the laps together. Let me see if I could get a move into the hairpin. And no, I cannot. So we gotta. Uh, I wonder where I can make the pass. This is the best part of the track for me, right here. All the way up until turn five, essentially, turn six. So, oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Why am I losing the rear end there? Just really doesn't make any sense. Uh, let's see. Right, stay in third gear. Here comes four and five. Nice. 
Nice. Right there, right there. Gas it up. Ooh, I am dirty. I am a very dirty driver. I should not have been making contact there. Shift into second gear. Drive away. Protect into turn seven. Protect, protect, protect. And, or is this turn six? I have no idea. Whatever. Uh, turn seven, turn six, turn five, turn four. Who cares? And into that as we're in third place. I can go cat. I mean, there's a chance. I'm not going to count ourselves out. Gordon isn't really pulling away. If I could put together the laps, let's see what tire wear is like. I mean, there's a chance. Six laps in and I'm sweating. <laughs> I knew this would be tough. This, I knew this would be one of the toughest races of the season. I, I am trying so hard to keep up with those guys. And I'm not really making mistakes, so I am proud of myself. But I don't think I can keep this up for the entire race. I'm going to keep trying because they're right there. I know if I put together the laps, I mean, I'm literally on the limit. If I put together the laps... Ah, I messed up there. I can catch them. Look how close they are. They, they really haven't pulled away at all. So, I just gotta keep. I just gotta keep pushing until they really start pushing or pulling away from me, and I, I really don't feel like I can catch them. Then I'll back off and play it more conservatively. But, oh my God, <laughs> I'm so sideways. Oh, I'm gonna hate myself if I wreck. I really am. Cause, oh, uh, I, should I be really pushing this hard? I want to win. I want to win. Look, look, look. See. Look how dirty that lap was, and we're still catching. If I could just put it together, if I can put it together, man, I'm telling you, there's a shot. Oh, look at this run. Oh, got a little bit sideways, but it's fine. We're up to Tony. Nice and easy. Let's get the run. Just get the run. I don't I don't need to try to make a pass here into the S's. Now we just follow. 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 Be right on him. Be prepared to, for an opening to show up. Nice and easy. Back off. There we go. Get the run. Get the run. All right. Back off. Wait. Just got to wait. Just got to wait. Set it up. Back off into the third gear. Dip the right side tires into the dirt. And this is where you got to make the move. Ooh. It's nerve wracking getting into the hairpin. And what a I'm let's go. Let's go. That That is how you make the moves, baby. That is how you make the moves. And Stuart just drove into the wall. <laughs> All right, Gordon. Come to me, my friend. No. That's a caution? <sighs> well, there's mistake number one. Um, but that's a really difficult place to bring out a yellow. I, I need a pause. Can I pause? Can I pause? Okay. Where are we? Are we sixth? Okay, we're on lap nine. We were halfway on fuel on lap seven, I think. It's a 27 lap race. If I pit here, I don't think I can make it. Are they gonna pit? Oh my, what do you do here? Uh, if I stay out, I can make it on one stop. I think it would have been close. I need to keep the track position. Um, so we are going to, cause you would restart, you'd restart lap 12, right? I can't go 15 laps on a tank of fuel. Um, so I, I think I have to stay out. Let's, I just want to see what they do. I'm just going to put it on yes or just wait. Look, I'm looking. I don't think anyone's pitting. No, they are pitting. They're pitting. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, that was important. So, again, I wasn't going to pit, but if everyone else is pitting, that, that might be a bad sign too. That might be a bad sign because that, that means they can make it to the end if they pit here. And I don't think I can. So that caution might have been more than just a mistake. It might have really ruined this race for us. And I am going to hate myself if that is the case. We won't know until the end of the race, but it looks like it could have been pretty bad. Oh, there's a mistake. First mistake in a long time. That's a long mistake. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> uh, what, did they take two tires? What the heck? I think the leaders took two tires. Mark Martin. Oh, no, we're good. Okay. Uh, I guess, never mind. There's Kevin Harvick. I think he beat us. Oi, 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 hey, 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 don't take me the car. Okay, we are P5, lap 11. I cannot make it to the end. If they can make it to the end, we are screwed, ladies and gentlemen. I can't let Gordon pull away as much as I did on the first run, so let's see if I can probably make some moves. Can I hang it around the... Oh, Harvick's going. Hold on. Wait, wait, let's wait. Watch these two. What are they going to do? Can we take advantage? Just got to be patient. Just got to be patient. Remind myself to be patient. We're not making any moves through here. We're just going to wait for the hairpin. All right, here's the move. See you later. Go to the inside. Don't overdrive it. Could get two for one if we stay on the bottom here. 
right by the tire barriers. Uh, we'll just get one. Did we get him? No, he says he's still there. Nope, we got him. Thank you. What a move. What a move. Clear. Now we just get on the brakes. Okay, I'm going to have to figure something out there. I'm backing up the corner. I think I probably have to run it in third gear. I'm, I'm pretty sure because I'm every time I shift to second, I'm, I'm losing the rear end. And that's only going to get worse as the tires wear out. So I, I got to stay in third gear, essentially from from turn three up the hill all the way until turn six. I need to stay in third gear. I can't be shifting to second gear. All right, let's see. Third gear through here. It's, I mean, uh, I'm going to have to figure that out. I don't really know what to do. <laughs> I don't know what to do. I shift in a second, it gets loose. I stay in third, it's still loose, but then it gets tight off. It's just junior. This is my patent move. I don't even really got to drive it in too deep into the hairpin. I drove it in too deep. Yeah, please don't cross me over. Don't cross me over. I'm back. Are you there? I don't know. Where are you? There you are. Okay, we're clear. Somehow that worked. Incredible. All right, dreaded turn six. Come on. Back it up. Stay in third. That's much better. All right, if I could just do that every lap, then we'll be fine. Take care of those Goodyear Eagles. I completely messed up the first left-hander. That's what caused me to lose it. Oh, you gotta be so precise. I'm just, I knew this would happen. I knew I'd make too many mistakes in this long of a race. It's just, especially with the way I gotta hold the controller, it's so uncomfortable. <laughs> My hands are cramping already. It's only lap 16, I'm just, I mean, my right hand feels like it's getting extended by a squid. It feels like a, an octopus has my right fingers, and they're just stretching them to oblivion. And especially my middle finger right now is just being stretched to God, and I just... I feel like I'm getting a finger workout right now. I, that sounds really bad. I, I, I should have not... I'm sorry. The tire wear is also a big problem. I'm starting to lose the rear end in areas where I shouldn't be losing it. I'm not driving it in deep. <laughs> I'm braking before the AI do, and I just, I can't. I just simply cannot. I, I, I don't know if it's really a tire wear issue or, or what is going on, but I'm just really struggling at the moment. Uh, let me check fuel. 11.7. We restarted. There's no way I can make it. If I am essentially going to be, you know, three laps short, it looks like. Three to, you know, it looks like it's going to be three laps. I'm not sure how everyone else can make it, but then again, our fuel efficiency is pretty bad. So, this goes one or two ways. I mean, either... Wait, no, 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 no. Look look at the track map. I, just, I didn't even notice this. If you guys look at the track map, people have pitted. People have pitted. There's Gordon, the leader, in the S's, and then you can see people crossing the star finish line. So, I am guessing that they... And that just changes everything. I was just a... Uh, <laughs> I was just about to say, oh no, I just picked up damage. I didn't hit that debris. I did not hit it. I saw it. I did not pick it up. Man, I got front end damage because of that. Um, I was just about to say, do we pit? Because I think, uh, we've just lost so much track position. Oh my god. I was, I was literally just about to pit. Once I realized that the, 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 there, there were guys that pitted, I was going to pit. And this mofo just blew his hood right in front of Gordon. And we've just lost 15 positions, it might have been. Oh, my. This race has been just... Uh, th these races are very unpredictable. When you get to 25%, so incredibly unpredictable. This is going to cost Gordon. It's going to cost Junior. It's going to cost me. It's going to cost a lot of guys. Who had the intelligence to pit? We will see. I am going to repair some of the damage. And, uh, oh, my goodness. This last... You know, 10 laps, last 7 laps is going to be an all-out dogfight. My lord. Another mistake. <laughs> They're only making mistakes under caution, which I'm perfectly okay with, guys. I, I believe in the law of averages. Get the mistakes out of the way uh, in, the, in the cautions in races that they're not that important. Um, I, I don't mind. Look, that mistake cost us, what, 2, 3 spots. It's way better than losing seven on, on, under green flag conditions, trust me. Um, where are we? We are 19. Okay, let's uh, quickly just pause here. We need to see the race scenario. We got Ryan Newman, Dale Jarrett, Ward Burton, Matt Kenseth, and Ashton Lewis. These slow cars, I'm telling you. Ashton Lewis, Craven, Marlon Johnson, they're fine. Montgomery, Waltrip, Petty, Mears, Biffle, 
all in front of Gord. Where did Stewart go? <laughs> Where's Tony Stewart, guys? Did he blow an engine? No, he's 25th. I don't know why he's falling back. Well, buckle your seatbelts, everyone. This is going to get very hectic. Uh, we're going to need a lot of patience here. There are only a few passing zones as Labani is going below me. And I'm almost wrecking. I think I shifted in a third too early. This is going to get chaotic. Very, very chaotic. Very quickly. Oh, boy. Okay, we got to slow up here. Just be careful. This is one of my areas where I can just cut across and get some... Uh, get some. Oh, get on the brakes. Get on the brakes. Get on the brakes. Ah, uh, 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 no. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I just... I, I, I was on the... I was on the brakes. No, oh, no, no. And that, didn't see that one coming. We got a ton of damage. I'm in second gear. We got to get around Biffle. What's the car looking like? It's, to be fair, still yellow. Not, not terrible. I am just trying to... Who's on my left? Rusty Wallace is on my left. Hello, Rusty. I'm going to just try and maintain the inside. Nope, he's going to... Okay, all right. We're just beating and banging here. Ooh, nice and easy. Don't lose it. I, I should have went up on the wedge. I should have went up on the wedge. My car is too loose. It is too loose. Just get, get around Biffle. Keep up with Mark Martin and Junior. I'm going to have to use that hairpin to my advantage. We're losing so much time in this traffic. Oh, my goodness. Where can we make the passes? I'm going to have to use... Oh, Junior, why are you getting loose? <laughs> Oh my goodness, uh, I'm going to have to make the passes right here. Just be patient. Just drive it into the gravel, essentially. I didn't do anything there. It is so tough to pass around here. It is. I'm going to have to shift into second gear here, try to get the run. Get a run. Go around the out- Casey Mirrors is so slow. I should be able to get him on the outside. There we go. Got him on the outside. Someone might to be my inside. That was Junior to my inside. We're clear of him. Now we got Montgomery here. Got to just find a way around his slow ass. I, I mean, this is... I, I cannot be stuck behind him. So let's just get the car turning. Hairpin is going to be crucial. We still got time to get into the top five. That's the goal right now is getting the top five into turn 10. Beautiful scenes into the hairpin. Good. 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 And perfect. I had to pause because my dog came into my room. And I, I close my door, obviously, when I'm recording. So <laughs> I was in a rhythm. I hate when I get out of rhythm, especially at road courses, man. You always got to stay in rhythm. It's so important. All right. Get back comfortable. Am I, am I in the right? All right. Let's go. Um, we are in P9. So right now this is working beautifully. We're first first car uh, that, you know, came out of pit road. I think that's actually Mark Martin's first car that came out of pit road. Um, I'm not going to make a move here in the hairpin. We're just going to be patient. I wasn't in position. So be patient. I mean, I wasn't trying to make a move. He just left the, the door open, but it's fine. Uh, Ryan Newman and those guys, they're way ahead. So the, the race win is not possible, but top five, guys. Top five is very, very close. We can see that. It's Ricky Craven up there, and we just got to get to him uh, and get around Mark Martin. And, and to be fair, these guys aren't slow, but they're definitely not that quick. So we just got to be very careful and patient with them and prepare the moves. This is right here. One of them I'd like to make. All right, but I'm going to get stuck right here. This shifted into second gear. Back it up. Didn't get sideways there. Use the run. There we go. There we go. Come on. Stay on the bottom. Can I get both of them? Oh, making contact. I'm giving you room. Are you still there? Nope, we got you. There we go. Two for one into seventh. That was very crucial. Very crucial. Now we get to Sterling Marlin. A little bit sideways. Let's just make sure we can set it up. If we can get to it, I don't know what line he's running. That's going to help us into third through turn 10. Mark Martin and, and uh, Jimmy Johnson are going through a little bit of a battle. I'm going to go around the outside and just try to outbreak him. Nope, he outbreaks me. I go to the bottom. A little bit of contact. Ooh. I, I, am, I have been just brutalizing people this race. <laughs> oh, where are you going? Oh, you're in the wall. Okay, hold on. Oh, I'm too tight. Uh, I knew I should. That is not a place where you make passes. I don't know why I was trying it. And that is going to likely cost me seven. I am an idiot for even trying it. But I should be able to get that back real quick. Hold on. Right through here. Mark's going to close the door. Don't worry about it. Back it up. Shift in a second. They're going to go side by side. We're going to get a run out of God. And dive it into the bottom. Just make sure I'm there. I was not there. Okay. Oh, oh, side by side. No, I didn't even get one of them. No, no, I'm, I'm er, Nope, can't do it. So much, so much patience needed, my friends. So much patience needed. 
And now I am stuck. Uh, <laughs> can I quit? No, I, I gotta let him back go. I gotta let him back go. Okay, he just was there. That This has just not been shaped. I gotta just get to the bottom and make this move. Just force him to the outside. Going around the outside was the mistake. Why did I even try going around the outside? I should've just checked up, went to the inside, made that move. I just wasted a lap trying to get around him. And now we only have two laps to get back to the top five. Look how much faster we are. Arr, I hate traffic. I just hate that we, we can't pass in every corner, you know? You just gotta set, set up. Come on, come on, come on. I gotta drive it in deep here. I gotta, just, I gotta take a risk. That's just, I can't believe I didn't hit anyone. All right, cut through. And it, it, I took a risk and it didn't pay off. Look how slow you guys are. Just stop holding me up, please. Oh! I, okay. To be honest, I did not mean to do that. <laughs> I, I did not mean to do that. I, what I was trying to do was let him go. Now, obviously, I can't see out the right side. But I thought I was going to let him go. And... Uh... uh <laughs> I guess that's my fault? I mean, I was letting him go. I was obviously preparing to get to the bottom. And Mark was just going straight. And I... I you know, it... It happened so quickly. I, I don't know entirely what happened. But in the end, after three cautions and a 27 lap race... We come home in fifth. Ryan Newman wins. We maintain our top five, uh, you know, streak going on right now. But that was... <sighs> Lead changes were I, 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 I don't know what to... That's the most chaotic road course race I've ever been a part of. I knew 25% would be different. But, man, I, I didn't know... It, we, two cautions, I didn't know what was happening. You know, actually, one caution was my fault. And then we got the Brie cautions, fuel stuff, and just... Uh, <laughs> What 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 today. just happened? We'll I need time to recover from what just happened. I'm so confused. We should be in the top ten in points. We what? No? I'm one point behind the top ten. Oh my goodness, 318. Where's fifth? Uh, 254, 318. Well, Ryan Newman won, so that and Dale Jarrett finished in the top three. So that explains that scenario. So we lose ground to fifth, even though we finished fifth. But we gained ground on Burton. We gained ground on Gordon. Gained ground on Johnson. Um, so that's nice. At the front, Tony Stewart, Dale Jr., Mark Martin. I really feel bad. Mark Martin is such an angel, man. And I'm just out here destroying his life. Just beating into the side of his car over and over. Uh, yeah, I feel bad for that. Um, Daytona is up next. Now, guys, we won Talladega, but we did not win the 500. So, it's always uh, interesting to see how the speedway racing will be. Um, I want to win, obviously. That is going to be very, very important. But we will see how it goes. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Um, well, disclaimer, guys. If I don't upload tomorrow, Arsenal play Manchester United at 7.30 in the morning on Saturday. If I don't upload tomorrow, it is because Arsenal pissed me off and I'm just so annoyed that I just like, I can't get myself in a good mood to, to then record. I, I would literally come on here and just be like, hi guys, I, uh, you know, here we are playing this game or doing this and uh, I would be in a very annoyed mood. If we win tomorrow, I'm most likely going to record um, after I watch two hours worth of post-match footage and, you know, and all that. But I will, I'll tell you right now, if you, you know, around 5 o'clock tomorrow, go on Google, type in Arsenal versus Manchester United. Whatever that score was, that is going to indicate if I upload or not. I know that sounds stupid, but I care so much that it genuinely will ruin my day if something bad happens, okay? And I just, I simply cannot get myself to record. I, I, I understand it. This is my job, and I'm supposed to record. I, I, I simply cannot do it. I, I will be frustrated and I will just be depressed and angry and I just need to stay away from everyone. I don't need to be talking to a microphone. So hopefully you guys get the message. I am not mentally stable. <laughs> I, got, I got a lot of problems. So hopefully I will see you guys tomorrow. I really hope I will. If not, I'll see you guys Sunday post race review for Taladega. Uh, and I'll see you guys then. Take care of yourselves. Enjoy the rest of your day. Comment down below. Hit the like button if you enjoyed the video. Take care of yourselves. Peace out.